Hello and welcome to WCG's virtual open event taking place at our Worcestershire colleges. So let's uh, try and answer some easy questions first of all. Where can you study with WCG across Worcestershire? Well, uh, we're a big college group with seven colleges across Warwickshire and Worcestershire. And the three that we have in Worcestershire are in Malvern Hills, in Pershaw and in Evesham. So why three colleges? What's different about them? What can you study in each of these three? Well, let's take them one at a time. Evesham College, first of all. Evesham is a general further education college and it offers a wide range of technical and professional courses. So what we have uh, are things like art design and photography and business. You could do childhood studies or health and social care if you like to look after people. You could study for construction or engineering or motor vehicle if you, if you want to engage in one of the uh, one of the skilled trades. We have digital and cyber courses if IT is the thing that really switches you on. We also offer hair and media makeup uh, which are taught in our, our lovely salons and we have a wide range of supported learning programmes for students who need just that little bit more support. That's Evesham College. Pershaw College is a very different kettle of fish because Pershaw is a land-based college. In fact, it was originally a horticultural college only and is a national centre of excellence for horticulture. So, not surprisingly, you can study horticulture, including agri-tech at Pershaw College. We also have a very well-equipped animal centre there where we have many students on animal welfare and vet nursing courses. With all that space, We've made Pershaw College our sports base as well. And it's from there that we run the Cheltenham Town FC football development programme. We also have supported learning programmes at Pershaw too, uh, mainly in land-based subjects. So that's Pershaw. And finally, Malvern Hills College. Malvern Hills was originally the Malvern School of Art and therefore focuses an awful lot on art and design type courses for adults. But for our younger full-time learners, we have a fantastic hair and beauty centre where we offer barbering in our brilliant new barbering salons and we have beauty therapies as well. Malvern Hills is also a centre for access to higher education. So if you're a mature learner, you could study health subjects or art and design there. What's really important about Malvern Hills though is that for this September, we're opening a centre in the Malvern Hills Science Park where we'll be offering a level three programme in digital and cyber technologies. And that's specifically to support the, the cyber industry, which has one of its hubs based right there in Malvern itself. So if you're looking to work in this fast growing industry, then get your application in for our digital and cyber course at Malvern Hills this September. But why would you choose to come to one of these three colleges? What is it? that's so good about WCG in Worcestershire? Well, you can see the reasons there and I'm going to just run through them quickly one at a time. First of all, you'll have seen already that we offer a very wide choice of subjects. If you're looking to study in a technical or professional area, then pretty much whatever you look for, we have it there for you. And especially given that Worcestershire has a lot of agriculture uh, and horticulture, our land-based provision at Pershaw is ideal for supporting the region's needs. And that's really what those three colleges are about. They're about providing the skills that are needed for the region's employment. And we've worked closely with Worcestershire County Council and also with the Local Enterprise Partnership to make sure that what you can study at Malvern Hills or Evesham or Pershaw will provide you with the skills that are needed for employment. And we offer courses at all levels. You can start at entry level in our supported learning programmes, but you can go all the way up to degree level because we even offer degree programmes there in our colleges. The facilities we have for all these subjects are industry standard. What it means is that you'll get a genuine work environment that uh, is preparing you really well for when you move on from college and into employment. The locations that we have, as you'll have seen from the map, are spread out across South Worcestershire, but they serve quite deliberately the whole of Witchhaven district as well. 
That means we've made sure that we have good bus routes into each of the colleges. Uh, it means providing rural services in some cases, so that even if you're in North Gloucestershire or across the Cotswold area, you'll be able to find a bus route into our colleges. And for this year, uh, to support the north part of Witchaven District particularly, we've provided a new bus route starting in Droitwich and coming down through the edge of Worcester itself and on to Pershaw and Evesham College. That way, wherever you are in our catchment, you should be able to get into college quite easily. Now, we count success at our colleges, not just in terms of pass rates and grades, but also, perhaps more importantly, in terms of where our students go on to. And we're very proud, as you can see from the stats on the screen here, to, to say that almost all of our students go on to very positive destinations. In some cases, 100% from some subject areas. And that means going on to either higher education to study at university, or at one of our own college degree courses, or it means going on into employment, which may well mean going on onto an apprenticeship. And again, we offer a wide range of apprenticeships for those students who choose that route. We also wrap around every student some fantastic support. If you have a, an academic support requirement or a health need, so long as you tell us about that when you apply, then just like you've had it at school, we can provide support for you in the classroom to help you overcome any obstacle you have. We also have learning support for every one of our students, dedicated study support and advice. A lot of that comes through your personal or your academic tutor, because they're there to help every student to overcome any barriers that you might find along the way in your studies. And we have the sort of student services that are exactly what you'd hope for at any college. There's financial support and advice, uh, telling you what bursaries you might be able to tap into to support you along the way. We have careers advisors at every college who can steer you in the right direction career-wise. We have a college nurse and counsellors to help you if you have any difficulties that way. And we have a welfare team. Not forgetting, of course, that you can join the Students' Union and make the most of your time at college to get a really rounded education with us. Talking of rounded educations, what we offer at WCG colleges is more than just a course. You see, you don't just study for your main qualification. If you need English or Maths, then you'll be able to study those alongside. You'll have tutorial support all the way through your course. We provide digital skills so that you, are, you come out fully prepared for industry and every student is uh, supported to get into an industry placement so that you have the opportunity to learn in a workplace and gain really valuable employability skills so that you're ready for work when you move on from college. So those are the reasons you may want to study at a WCG college. I guess one of the other questions you need to answer is, well, how do you get in? What are the entry requirements? Well, quite simply, there's different entry requirements for different levels of courses. And the good thing with college, uh, with WCG, whether you come to Evesham or Pershaw or Malvern Hills, is that we have different levels of courses. So if you feel like you're going to do well in your GCSEs, if you're going to come out with four or five past grades, grades four and above at the very least, uh, including maths and English, then you should be able to go on and study a level three programme. That's equivalent to three A-levels. Many of our students choose to follow one of those level three routes. But if you don't think you'll achieve that well, don't worry, because we also offer courses at level two, at level one, and at entry level for supported learning students. That means that whether you're going to come out with average grades of three or grades one and two, or if you're not actually sitting GCSEs, then there is still a course for you. The great thing about having these different levels, of course, is that whatever level you come in at, you'll be able to move up through the levels. So many of our students may be coming at level one or two, carry on up to level three and go on to degree level beyond. There's really no ceiling for you in terms of how well you can achieve with us at WCG. So last question then, how do you apply? It's very simple. Just go to our website, wcg.ac.uk, put in forward slash study 
and then go looking for the course that you want. We've grouped them by subject area and within each subject area you can find all the different levels of full-time courses. Just find the one that seems to be right for you and click on apply now. Fill in the application online, submit your application. That's it, job done for now. What we'll do is we'll get an offer to you uh, which will be sent to you by email and then later on in the year we'll invite you in to enrol for that course around the end of August when you'd normally be getting your GCSE results. So once you've applied, what I would recommend you do is get onto our social media. We're on Facebook and on Twitter, on Instagram and YouTube. You can find there a lot of resources, but what's really good about those social media is that you'll be able to see through the different stories shared just what college life is like, the kind of things that you could be doing when you join us in September this year. And we do look forward to seeing you then. Thank you.